Hello everybody, I'm going to go through some basic Charleston steps with you now. I'll do it without music to start with, then we'll put a little bit of music on and you can see how it looks with the music. So the first basic step is stepping forward, tapping, behind and tapping, step, tap, behind and step. We don't bother doing any swivelling, but if you can, when you're coming forward, you can swing your leg out to the side, but if that doesn't work for you, just keep it without the swinging out. The most important thing with Charleston is it's nice and bouncy and to help with the bounce, we do some arms, nice big arms, swinging the arms about. If you wish, if you want to take it a little bit higher, instead of tapping, you can always kick the leg out and kick it behind if you wish, however it works for you. The other step we're going to do is the flex the heel one, two, three, flex, flex, one, two, three. So unlike with most other types of dancing, you would point the toe. With a Charleston, it's all very angled. So the foot is flexed with a one, two, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three. You've really got to pull in the abs, the tummy muscles when you're doing this one, because it's balance. One, two, three, heel, heel, one, two, three. Now we've got a couple of other steps that we do. There's the basic, this one, or if we're going a bit more advanced, we can take it across. It's not so easy to do on the carpet. So we've got a bit of that, or a bit of going to the side. So those are our three basic moves. So we'll put some music on and I'll show you what it looks like to music. Second step, flex the foot, pull in the tummy. There we go, there's your basic Charleston. 